Two bucks. Uh, <laughs> also, a pretty good uh, pitching performance by the young man to finish off the second game. He was my fourth pitcher of the afternoon, pitched one inning, struck out two guys, and uh, bad managing on my part. I should have had him at the other end of the pitching order. So nice going, guys. We got the offense going. We'll just get I have to find myself ten dollars. I got the Canadians mixed up yesterday, so uh, I owe ten more. Soup. All right. Uh, Soup's didn't do so good yesterday. Uh, coach pitched game. Uh, we did have a gentleman that played third base in that game, like Brooks Robinson. And threw in a couple of hits besides Scott Durbin. Second game, we didn't do much in that one either. Uh, <laughs> we lost 15 to 8. I think we had two of those six run, six run rules. Uh, but this gentleman started at first base, pitched, and played third base. And did well at every position, plus he went uh, two for three with three RBIs. Mark Carcini. Dave, we are on field six today, so don't move. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck today, guys. How about Miller time? <laughs> Quick, two minutes. Oh, I, two minutes. No I got you on the two minutes. The last two, which reminds me of a story. We played Monty in the first game. It could have gone either way. I had thrown eight scoreless innings against my own team. <laughs> <laughs> he got fed up, came up with a six-run inning with only one out. It was best hit balls I've seen in a long time. And uh, the star of that game, and was actually our catalyst, was from, uh, he's the guy from furthest north <laughs> in this fantasy camp. He's from Grand Prairie, Alberta, Gary Smear. All right, Gary. Second game, I, I just want to state, my starting pitcher was Phil. He, you know, he hang, hung in there for two innings. It, it was the longest two innings I experienced in my life. <laughs> <laughs> then I decided to let the whole staff pitch, so we worked our way through just to see how we do it every game. The pros, they do that to see who can come up and pitch in big situations. And then about the third pitcher I had out there, next thing I do in a timeout, I look up and Barker's out there on the mound talking to him. <laughs> I got, I got Tudor and I sitting on the bench for both major league pitchers. And I said, what the hell is he going to tell us? Two dollars. <laughs> but uh, I thought uh, the best player, we only scored one run. We only got three hits. And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's going to be tough to find arms here. And I want to try and look all of you. And if you need help. Any of you come to me or come to Tudor, we can help you out. Make the throw strike. There's a lot of pitchers here. A lot of great pitchers in the, this camp this year. Don't come to me because I can't help you. <laughs> <laughs> he's different. He, he actually has got legs like uh, Tony Oliva. <laughs> <laughs> Mine bowl and his go in, but he should be able to hit a little better than he did. But the second game, I think uh, our best player, well, I know he's best player. He battled, had a good at bat. Drove on our only run. And uh, Vernon Page walked, scored, caught the whole game or most of the game. Did a great job. But I think uh, Nathan Green's most valuable player. Good job. I'm not like Dick. I ain't got no stories. <laughs> heroes in the first game and uh, those boys can hit you know a lot like uh, not like Bill I, I threw a shutout all the way to the seventh <laughs> inning <laughs> finally I started saying boys you got to stop hitting it at me because you know I gave out a few chips and they they gave them all back because I was the MVP <laughs> <laughs> We gave up 14 <laughs> in the uh, in the first game against uh, the Heroes. And we decided to keep playing football in the seventh, 
and uh, we got we at least we touched down. You know, we got a, we got a safety. Sorry, we, we tackled the quarterback back there. So we we did score in the first game, but the uh, you know I gave Jesse the MVP for the first game. He had a couple of RBIs, made some good plays deep short. So nice job. Anyway, we went one and one, as Ken said. Uh, in the coach pitch, we lost seven five to uh, uh, Trot's dirt bags on Mike's. If anybody else who wants to know, <laughs> uh, that was something else. He's just seeing his face on the mound. He's going. <laughs> In that game, uh, Mike Atwood went three for three with the run score and an RBI. He did a really nice job for us, so Mike was a star in the first game. <laughs> the second game against Campbell Soup, we came out with the help of uh, their starting pitcher. We got eight walks in the first inning. They put a six spot on the board. That helps when you score six runs early. But we, we ended up winning that game 15 to eight. And we decided to start the game uh, Mike Atwood pitched four shot innings to close the door, did a really nice job. We had really good help from a lot of people, but we gave the star of the game to Steve Kulik, went two for two with the walk and a run scored. Yeah. And he got to live. What was it, Steve? You got to live your what? What was it you did yesterday? Off my bucket list. Yeah. His, his first base hit gets a line drive to center field. He goes, Well, I can take that one off of my bucket list. So, <laughs> Steve. Hey, the first time I heard it, you know, like, uh, maybe he's just talking to somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> kind of ran by me and said, Mike. And, you know, me, the first time I heard it, I said, Mike. And I looked at Dalbro and he yelled it from the outfield. And I was like, I didn't want to interrupt Hernandez at bat. He had two strikes on him. I'd already thrown two neck balls at him. He fouled him off. So I just asked uh, Kyle and Frankie could introduce us. <laughs> Defensive, both teams did a great job being game one. Some of them have a little bit of nerves out there. Uh, we had several multi-hit games, but uh, player of the game was uh, Russell Uppengrove. It was three for three with three stakes. Uh, also, El Presidente Hernandez had a fantastic diving, uh, probably you know game-saving play early in the game. Line drive, made a nice stab with a with a bum knee, but. That was a great play. Game two wasn't the same. Turned off uh, slow. I don't know.